What's going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's Thinkies and Curious. I'm back here with another video for you guys here today. And by the title of the thumbnail, you guys can see that we have a review and somewhat um, a how to style. I want to put an um, outfit together for the Yeezy Gap Engineer. I want to show you guys how it looks with a full outfit. I'm even going to review what I did get. I got two shirts and a mask from the re um, latest drop that came out online. I did cop a few things and I just want to show you guys how it looks just in case you guys like it. You feel me? But if you guys do enjoy this video, please do not forget to like, comment, subscribe. Join the family if you haven't yet. If you want to stay connected with me, my social is on the screen and down below in the description box. And besides that, I do have my own clothing brand aside from that. So if you guys want to follow that, stay connected with that. The name is Tapping Through 5. Instagram, Tapping Through 5. Website, www.tappingthrough5.com. And as of right now, you'll be seeing what we do have in store for that for my clothing brand. So if you guys want to shop, go ahead. I really appreciate that. All right, so in this video, I'll be pairing up these items with some jeans, with some joggers, with some cargoes. So you guys can see how it looks and as well i'll be wearing the onyx fumerners with these outfits so you guys can see how i like it a full outfit looks with these items but again i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did do not forget to like comment subscribe now let's dive into these outfits all right so firstly we have this one we this one is the dove one so the easy gap um dove sleeve t and just by it's not even on me you can tell it's pretty huge and pretty big if you've seen the model pictures um, you will see that it is kind of oversized and I think on the description it says oversized so definitely if you are a small guy and you're not really sure how oversized T go just go with a smaller size than your usual size I went for a small I usually wear medium and regular shirts but I was like it's oversized so I went for a small and we're gonna see how it actually looks on me all right guys so this is how it looks on me so this again this is the easy gap stuff one and you have a cross in the front gap um, this is supposed to be a black colorway. I'm not sure how it's gonna look through the camera, but it's supposed to be black. Um, but from here and there in person, it does give you top of like a grayish green colorway vibe. But this is how it looks very oversized. You guys can see um, the, the sleeves are, I think, three fourths sleeves. And this is how the neck looks. I'm not really a crazy fan of the neck. Um, I already like the way it is. So the neck area kind of feels like a turtleneck, and I'm not really a fan of turtleneck shirts. But I'm gonna show you guys how it looks on the back, where the dove is at. And I think the dove looks pretty nice. And that's one of the reasons why I decided to pair it up with some gray jeans first, because this to get not really an all black um, type of vibe, but to have a, some type of different colorway to match the dove on the back, because the dove is like whitish. So I was like, I'm doing the gray jeans. And then we have the onyx bummers, how it looks. And this is the whole outfit. You know, comment below how you guys feel about the shirt. Um, I do. You know, for oversized seat, I do feel like it is kind of short at the, it is kind of short right here. It could have been a little longer because it looks kind of weird that it's oversized, but it reached right here. I'm not sure if that's just me or that's everybody else, but it's not too bad though. I'll definitely rate this an eight and a half. I do like it though. So now let's see how the masks look. So we got the bag. I think this is size small as well. The masks do have sizes. Yeah, it's a small. Small. Yeah, it's a small. And then I'm sure you guys how it looks. So y'all just seen how the mask look on me and honestly so the mask don't have no area for like a mouth like to just open your mouth it's just the eyes so you can see and it don't really have no like little spaces holes for your nose as well so you know just by that you guys can already know i mean it's breathable in there i'm not saying you can't breathe you can breathe but it just it's different you know it's different to, compared to your regular mask so i'm just gonna say that so if you're wearing glasses with it definitely the glasses gonna fog up because you can't really breathe regular if you're wearing glasses so you're gonna see a lot of fog fogged up in your glasses so definitely that's how the mask is but besides that um i did want to show you guys how the shirt look with um all black um this is a cargo jogger so this is how this shirt would look the dove shirts this is how it looks with this um pants 
And this one is from Boohoo. And the gray jean as well is from Boohoo. Just in case you guys are wondering. I know you guys can ask that in the comment. But this is how it looks. The farm runner's on it. That's how it looks. Oh guys, my head can't fit. Hold on. For a second shirt. So actually I struggled to put my head in this shirt. Um the collar area was very tight for this one. I'm not too sure if that's all. Um let me know if you do have this exact shirt, the gap um logo one. And let me know if it was a little um struggle to put your head in. I'm not sure if my head is big, but it was very like it was a struggle to put it in. But I'll do say that this shirt actually is like the black colorway compared to the other shirt. Um, the Dove shirt um, actually looks black. I'm not sure how you guys see it in the camera, but it actually looks black in person. And yeah, like I said, little gap right here. Nothing crazy on the back, plain black. But if you do want, if you do want that dark black color vibe, Kanye and Yeezy like to give, there it is. I got, I got it with a big um cargo black cargos. Um, this cargo you can find it anywhere. Um, I got this one from Walmart, but you could get any cargos like this from anywhere basically. And this is how it looks with the Foam Runner Onyx. And yeah. The material for both these shirts are 100% cotton and it's very heavy. It's not something that's thin, it's very thick and heavy. So the quality, I'll do say, is very good. So definitely worth the price tag if you don't mind paying that price. Like I, and again, I, um, this is 120 this one and then the double one I believe is 140 you know and the mask I'll double check I'll probably put in a video or in the description because I did forget how much the mask cost but if anything I'll let you guys know at the end of the video but it's how it looks I just showed you guys how it looks with cargos, but this is how it looks with jeans. So this is a all black um, flare jeans. Um, this jean is from Google, so just in case you guys wondering. But this is how it looks with the Gap logo, easy Gap logo shirt. You know, still that all black type of vibe. You know, that kind of love so much. You know, it looks nice. Um, I didn't rate this shirt yet. But for my rating for the shirt, I'll definitely say this shirt because it's just a little small um, little gap logo. I'll definitely rate it as an eight. And then for the Dove shirt, I guess it's an eight and a half, but I'll boost it up to a nine because I'm really feeling it. I do like the Dove in the back. I think that looks pretty dope. So definitely that is a nine and this one is an eight. Alright guys, so we're about to end this video off. So that was pretty much it. Um, for the mask, I did get the price. The price is $40. The retail price was $40. I got this for $40 on the um, website when it launched. Um, comment below how you guys feel about this whole video. Comment below, comment below how you guys feel about the whole drop. This whole Yeezy Gap engineered by Balenciaga. Comment below if you guys liking what Yeezy Gap and Balenciaga is doing together. If you guys are looking forward to more um, releases. Um, they did have a lot of pop-ups going on um, um, last week. They had New York. They had... um. Miami, I think Chicago, I'm not, um, if I'm not mistaken. But, you know, Yeezy and Gap Balenciaga is doing their thing right now. And I'm pretty excited to see what they have in the future. I do like these, these type of items that they get. So probably next time, the next drop, I'll probably get more items. That's why I didn't really go crazy because it was my first time. I just wanted to see how everything was. So I'm like, I'm just get a little small amount of items and not, to go, and not go too crazy. So next time I'll get a little more. And definitely when I do get some more things, I'll definitely provide more videos for you guys. You know, so if you do, if you guys did enjoy this video, please do not forget to like, comment, subscribe. It's Sneakers and Chris. Comment below again what you guys think, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.